Oh, hello everyone. Man, uh, I was in the middle of recording my Star Wars Masterworks opening and the daggone camera on my phone failed. The, the recording failed. So I'm, I just started into my second box. I guess I'll recap what I got in the first box. We had uh, this cool sketch here. And it's signed, but I have no idea who the artist is. If anybody knows who this artist is, let me know in the comments below. We also pulled a blue parallel auto of Mary Elizabeth McGlynn as uh, Governor Price. We got a Mercedes Veronado as Casca Reeves auto and a Saucy 10 stamp. We got a, some parallels. Blue, mostly blue, one purple bantha that's numbered. Um, I mean, that's really it. I'll, you know, we got a numbered parallel of one of the Vader inserts. But I just started into my second master box, into the first mini mini box, and uh, the camera died on me. So uh, we'll just start from here. This one is definitely has a chunky medallion card here so we'll start from the back we got a cool blue Darth Maul um, parallel and my camera's still acting a little weird hopefully this is working here Uh, an R2-D2, vintage R2-D2, Kenner action figure, subset card, IG-11, Admiral Akbar, and oh, if it's a medallion, it's nice to get a one that matches the character. So R2 with an R2 medallion, and this is green, so this will be numbered to 99. It's 77 of 99, so that's pretty good. Uh, I think I'm out of... Actually, you know what? I'm just not going to post post that one in the background. It's just a medallion. I am going to be selling that on eBay. I'll probably... I don't know. I might keep the stamp. I'm definitely going to sell the parallels. Oh, I'm not going to put the set together. And I'll probably sell off the singles or try to anyways. Of the base cards and the insert cards. And just keep... Actually, I'll probably try and sell that blue parallel McGlynn auto as well. So. All right. We got Bib on the front. We have a Crit Dragon. And this is numbered to 10. So that's our lowest numbered parallel so far. That's cool looking. We have another... We have the Emperor's Royal Guard action figure card, Bib Fortuna, Qui Gon Jinn, and our second hit is a lowly nobody background character from the Mandalorian, Philip Alexander, Imperial Security Officer. These are the kind of crappy autographs that I've seen a lot of other people pull out of their boxes. That's why I was kind of shocked with the ones. I got out of the first one. Actually, I'm not gonna have him block any of those. Those are better hits. So that was, a, like I said, most of the autos I've seen people pull out of these breaks have been very underwhelming for the most part. That's why I'm hoping I get another sketch out of this second box. There's usually three, three sketches per eight box case, so take a little bit of luck for me to get one my my buddy pulled three autos out of his box that we uh, recorded last night yeah i finally finished i finally fixed what was wrong with the camera so hopefully that helps we have a blue parallel kira so that's a nice card we have a vintage princess leia Hoth action figure. We have a Darth Maul. Actually, put him 
here we have a special this is like a metallic card and we have another stamp and it can oh this is super low number this is a, i guess a black this is a one of five anakin skywalker stamp sweet so i've hit some pretty low numbered actually that's worthy of worthy of putting up in the background here that is a pretty sweet card Let's see if we can fit it in the picture here move these guys over a little bit so if you're going to get a stamp a super short print numbered to five black parallel would be what you would want and then this guy is also numbered to 299 number 44 out of 299 so another parallel that's a pretty good mini box and this is our last mini box so this should be our second autograph and i hope it's somebody good There's nothing fancy in there, so it's not going to be a super short print one. It's probably going to be a regular uh, cartoon character or somebody like that. Uh, we have a green parallel fin, numbered to 99, 24 of 99. We have a George Lucas uh, 50th anniversary of lucasfilm is this one numbered no so it's a regular one all right we have kira on the front jana and our last auto is another oh well it's he's not bad he was a major character in the last movie Allegiant General Pride, Richard Grant. So, eh, it's not bad. That is it. Uh, first box was super killer. Second box was mediocre, like most of them. Although, no, I take that back. We got a one of five black Anakin Skywalker stamp, so... Yeah, I'm pretty pleased with overall with those two boxes. Um, really, only one bad autograph some sweet parallels and inserts which again like i said i'm going to sell to recoup some of my money back and like i said uh in in the first recording which died uh i brought in some of my biggest hits from openings from this year and the past and some of the some of my favorite cards in my collection um we have my one my two of five triple auto of the um, first order guys from the Disney trilogy that I pulled out of Star Wars signatures about a month ago. And same thing, we have a low numbered Wicket, uh, Warwick Davis, one uh, number eight of 10. So that's a gold parallel. Uh, we have my Darth Maul sketch from Carlos caballero that i pulled out of a holocron box about a year or so year and a half ago uh, my two chrome autos i had mads nicholson and john carlo esposito this was a cool card i pulled about a month ago this is a dark saber metal child insert out of mandalorian season two numbered five out of five so that's another super short print insert my Dryden Voss source relic fabric numbered in uh, 90 out of 99 that I got out of, um, I forget the set. I forget what it's called. I think it's Chrome, Chrome Galaxies or Cal Galaxy Chrome. I don't know. I can't remember. I opened so many things up now. Videos on, on the channel if you want to look it up. But, you know, 
So that's it. If you, uh, if you guys like what you saw, please hit the like button. Drop a comment down below. Let me know if you were able to buy any of these and if you hit anything big and what your big hits were. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel, I wish you would consider doing so. It would help us out. And share this video with your friends who are into collecting Star Wars. Thanks a lot. Have a good night.